Okay, hello dear friends. Here we have another uh, parabola problem. So the teacher asks us to find out the vertex, the focus, and the directrix, directrix, and then do the graph. Okay, so it's a parabola. I will first write down the question y squared minus 4y plus 4x plus 4 equal to 0. So when we see it, y to the power of 2 and x to the power of 1, the highest degree is 1, the highest degree is 2. So it is a parabola. So when we see parabola, take some time to do the cheat sheet. Okay? And I will just do it here, a cheat sheet. And the parabola has two kinds. I will only do this kind instead of doing it the 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 the, the, the downside. The, the the way down the way down you just treat the le the p is smaller than one the method of doing it is the same and this okay so this is h k the vertex and this is the focus here is the directrix, and this is the line of symmetry. So we will write it down. The format, the formula for it is y, no, x minus h square equal to 4p y minus k. This is the standard form where the, the vertex is at h and k. Write it down. Vertex, vertex is h and k. And uh, the focus, focus is h still does not change and the, 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 the uh, x value does not change because it's always on the same line and the y value this distance is actually p so it's k plus p and the directrix directrix is the y value k minus this distance p y equal k minus p so this is the cheat sheet the most important thing for us to remember this is the graph and the directrix line of symmetry vertex focal point and uh, line of symmetry line of symmetry is the x value x does not change is always the h x equal to h so with this we get clear and this one the vertex is at h and k and here is the line of symmetry and this is the p distance p distance and this focal point is what does change it changes on x value h 
plus p and k, the y value does not change. And what is this line of uh, 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 directrix is directrix x equal to x equal to h minus p okay and this is the 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 the, the line of symmetry line of symmetry is y equal to k okay so the formula for this one is y minus k square equal to 4p x minus h so the vertex let me erase this top stuff vertex h okay and focus h will change h plus p it's actually kind of symmetry and k does not change and directrix tricky tricks is x equal to h minus p and line of symmetry is y value y equal to k so this two uh, cheat sheet is very important for us to figure out this method so here come back to our problem we see this y to the power of four we need to uh, complete the square there is four okay we can just use up this four right away i will write down uh, in another way y square minus 4y plus 4 plus 4x equal to 0 and in addition you can change the space it is uh, change the, the order it will be the same so y minus 2 square plus 4x equal to 0, y minus 2 square equal to negative 4x. And uh, we figure out this equation, and then we can just go back here. So the vertex, uh, let's first figure out the p. p equal to 4p equal to negative 1, so p is negative 1. So vertex, vertex is x is 0, x is 0, y is 2. And focus, focus, uh oh, this we will use this formula. Focus will be h plus p so it's negative one zero plus negative one is negative one k is two and directrix direct directrix is x equal to h which is zero uh, zero minus negative one is one x equal to one positive one and line of symmetry they didn't ask but we are anyway y equal to k k is two y equal to two Okay, with all this value here, now we can draw this. And also, we know the P is negative. This is negative, so the, the graph will be just opposite on this side.
and uh, and uh, we know the p is one so it's quite uh, it goes to this side and it's quite um, quite uh, fat quite fat you know what i what i mean in in um in comparison with the the line of symmetry is quite fat okay so the vertex is zero two zero one two so this is the vertex and the focus is negative one two vertex negative one two zero two negative one two and x equal to positive one and y equal to two is the line of symmetry and this is a directrix use pink line for the directrix and this will be the graph. This will be the graph. This will be the graph. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm pretty right on this. So this one, we got it right. Let me check with my decimal and see if I'm correct. Decimal, decimal. So let's take a look here. So the vertex is here and this is the here will be the the negative one and two will be the focal point focus and this will be the line of symmetry we are doing it a little bit too fast In Oh, this is actually a thin graph. Mm -hmm. I got it a little bit wrong for that. It's a thin graph. Y, y equal to 4x. Mm -hmm. It's a thin graph, not so thin. Still, it's quite thin. Okay, question number 50. I copied this problem so that uh, I can see because the book publishing is too small. And uh, still we are looking for vertex, focus, directrix and graph. And in the previous video for question number 49, we have already figured out the formula for doing this, uh, 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 the formula of the cheat sheet. We worked it out, so copy the problem, x squared plus 6x minus 4y plus 1 equal to 0. Let me take a look again. We do not want to waste our time on doing this. Okay, so we are right. So it... First, we need to complete the square, x squared plus 6x plus 9. From nowhere, we add up a 9, and then we need to minus a 9. 
and then copy the rest, rest minus 4y plus 1 equal to 0. Why do we plus 9? Because we want to complete the square. x plus 3 square, and this used up. Negative 1 and positive uh, negative 9 and positive 1 is negative 8. Minus 4y minus 8 equal to 0. So x plus 3 square equal to take out 4. 4y plus 2. So here we can understand the p equal to 1. We will use use this formula x square x square yes so the uh, vertex vertex is negative 3 negative 2 focus focus is eight will not change negative three negative two plus one negative one directrix the rec tricks y equal to k is uh, negative two and p is positive 1, k minus p, k minus 1, negative 2 minus negative 1 is negative 3. Line of symmetry x equal to negative 3. Okay, so we will put on to the paper to do a graph. Negative 3, negative 2, negative 3, 1, 2, 3, negative 2, 1, 2, here, negative 3, negative 2, and it should go up. Go up and um, negative three, negative one, negative three, negative one. This is the 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 this is the focus focus here and line of symmetry x equal to negative three. See, and the uh, directrix y equal to one, two, three. Yeah, we are right. Do we need to try on decimal? We do not need to.